Only on Fox tonight, five Houston high school students beat out thousands of other students across the country and in the UK in a prestigious international math competition. Our Randy Wallace reports tonight. This is not just to go take a math test and get a number of answers right and win a competition. This is a taking that knowledge to the next level and actually using it. P equals sigma of alpha of n. K value was small. These teens from St. John's School did something a lot of adults couldn't do. Spend 14 hours focused on finding a solution to a real world question. Their question, the predicted growth of e-bike use and its impact on society. Hundreds of teams are getting the exact same problem and we need a way to distinguish ourselves from the other teams. Students all over the country and the UK competed in the MathWorks Math Modeling Challenge. They all had the same 14-hour deadline. We are all sitting in like my living room, uh, in my house, a um, bunch of people on the couch. I had my computer, and yeah, we had a white. We brought a whiteboard from school. A lot of food, and yeah, it's a lot of fun. It didn't feel like 14 hours. Some of us say that it felt like a really long time, but to me, it went like really, really fast. I mean, there must have been times when you all didn't agree. Absolutely, especially as the competition drew to a close. After that, the hours were getting long. Some people were getting kind of tired and more difficult to work with. I will say that I myself might have been one of them. But I mean, there were probably times when you wanted to smack each other, right? Yeah, for sure, for sure. Um, <laughs> Like we were literally just trapped in like one room the entire time for 14 hours, and we were just sitting there on the desks working the entire time. And I can definitely say that tensions did get pretty high. But I think I just learned a lot about myself um, and working with other people through this long, uh, long competition. That's the nature of the beast: is that if you want a problem solved, you get really good people together and you put them in the same room and you don't let them come out for a while. The St. John's team is one of the top 16 teams in the nation. This Sunday, they will compete in the finals in New York. It was insane. We actually found out at our prom. We literally screamed. We took a photo right then, and it was just, it made prom so much better. Randy Wallace, Fox 26 News.